Um, just taking his time, apparently. What is the matter? Hmm. No, I don't think so. I think they could probably take the queen, don't you? Oh, he's, he's being very formal here. Oh, in fact, wow. Okay, yeah, Zidane thinks so too. Want you to escort the princess out of Alexandria and take her to Dr. Tots. Well, that is a damn good plan. He is definitely someone we can trust. Yeah. We certainly will. I'm counting on you. I bid you farewell. Our Stein is going to be noble and heroic and... Stopping now. Oh. Uh, we're gonna have to fight it without Steiner's help, that sucks. To be honest though, I don't think Freya and Beatrix are in any danger. I really don't. Beatrix alone could probably just decimate the entire fucking Alexandrian army, for God's sake. Although technically decimate means... Does it not mean divide by ten? Or something? I don't know. I think decimate actually means something else. Technically. I don't know. It just sounds cool. Alright, let's go. Go, go, go. What a swap in between characters here. Look at this. We got Beatrix. Oh, nice dodge. attack. Of course it is. You can kill a bunch of dogs. Right, should we go for... I think we go for... Mm, shock's pretty expensive MP-wise, but we'll do it anyway. Bit overkill, but fuck it. Oh, I don't know what I did then. What did I do? I use Lancer by accident. Nice one! Oh, I don't like bitch. Oh, you put us to sleep. Don't you dare like Beatrix, that's my job. It's funny though, because all this time we've been fighting her and she's had like over 3000 HP and suddenly she's down to like 1200 or whatever it is. I always, that always annoyed me a little bit. I'm, I'm like, well, why can't why can't we get the the most badass version of Beatrix? Why does she have to be nerfed as soon as we get control of her? No, they're not. Piece of piss. Oh, here he comes. Here comes Tubs Tubster, Rusty Tubster. We know who you are. That's cool, though. Grants me the honor of assisting you, brave knights. <laughs> Alright, this should be a bit easier now. Before it was like taking candy from a baby. Now it's going to be like taking candy from a baby that is asleep with animal tranquilizer. Go for a stop break. Well, that attacks both of them, actually. I do like Beatrix's sword, the uh, Save the Queen, I believe it's called. You can actually get uh, that sword's card. I'm not sure how. Welcome to level 20, Steiner! And back with Zidane! Hmm. I wonder. Oh, shit. Okay. I was going to try and talk to the Moogle again, but I, maybe... Oh, for fuck's sake. Not again. What? 
<laughs> yeah, we kind of are. You bastards. Bastards we may be, but clever are we. I've always liked that line. Hee hee hee. Oh yeah! Oh yeah, it's blank! Oh, just in the nick of fucking time. I bet it is. Who's Dagger? <laughs> That's a good point. Well, of course he doesn't know. Jeez. Oh, time for another drink. Nice one. So you must, guy. You, you must, guys. You guys must know a way out. Thanks. Oh, we can ride the gargant downstairs. So heading back to Treno. I mean, yeah, we want to go back to see Top, don't we? So. Yes, we do. Ah, Gargan Roo, yeah. Fossil Roo's a different place, actually. I've sort of spoiled that, but... Oh, it's not really a spoiler. So, of course, Zidane has never actually been here, and neither has Vivi. But Zidane had heard of it, so there's something coming. That would be the Gargant. We need to... Uh... Oh no, it just stopped. We definitely are. Just just come with us to Treno. A bit cheesy, but okay, makes sense. Let's have a pleasant ride on the Gargant to Treno. Oh shit! The Gargant was like, fucking hell, guys, I'm not waiting any longer. We're going to Treno, we'll stay there for a time being and try to figure out our next move. So, does Zidane know that Tot's in Treno? <laughs> Maybe he doesn't just yet. Oh crap. Not again. You again? I mean, you look kind of different this time. Oh, okay, maybe it is a different one. So, another boss fight. It's just never ending. Ugh. Ugh. Ugh, it's just it's the same, but it's green. I'm not sure. Is this guy classified as an undead enemy? I don't know, I might be getting confused. Um, can't even remember what this guy's weak against. Ralvui Margo. I don't know. I'm butchering that. Right, let's get some... Shell. Shit, Vivi's still got water reflect. Okay, yeah, he's pretty weak to ice, I think. Mm, dagger. Steel, steel, steel. If this guy is undead, I suppose I could kill him with healing spells or... Maybe even a phoenix down, but I don't know. I'll try it after I've stolen what I need to. Very interested to see if it does work. Well done, buddy. That's, uh... That what? Still... Oh, that's because it was targeting all of us. Right, Dagger, you need to do some healing. Ah, but it still goes back on him, too. But Thunder doesn't do much at all. I have no idea what this guy has, I have no idea how much health he has. I did not research this guy at all. Is that going to hurt him? No, okay, so he's not undead. I'm completely wrong. Ultra sound wave. Uh-oh. Oh, mini! Oh, that sucks. 
Do I have anything that can cure that? No, I don't think I do. Shit. You know what? We'll try casting blind on it. Couldn't steal anything, of course. There he goes. Focus again, Vivi. Cute little tiny dagger. I think a remedy might cure it. But we don't really need to. I, I read that as you stole Adam West. <laughs> no, not an Adam and Vest. It's Adam West. I like it. This is ridiculous. Why the steel rate so bad all of a sudden? This is just, this is phenomenal, how bad this steal rate is. I don't even know what it is though, that's the problem. I don't know if it's something that's worth stealing. It probably is, but you never know. I could have already got one of these pieces of equipment and I'm wasting time. You big sweaty bag of monkey scrotums, Dane. Fucking steal, man. Mother of dicks. It's taking too long, way too long. Been recording for five weeks. Oh, oh boy, it is testing my patience now. Oh, it's testing my patience. I think I'm dead inside. You are taking the fucking piss. I think I'm just gonna, I don't know, go out find a squirrel maybe and just sort of throw it onto the nearest motorway. I think that'd be more entertaining. What a sweaty, leaking bag of diseased camel dicks. Oh, come on. I just want to steal. <laughs> I just want the item, whatever the fuck it is. I don't care, just give it me. Finally! Fucking finally, the oak staff! Mother of fucking dynamite! Jesus, hippo shits! I don't. I've lost it. I, I can't record anymore. That's it. I'm done. He doesn't have anything else. Thank fuck for that. Right, let's kill the prick. That was in s just unreal. Un fucking real. Yeah, how do you like that? I swear that I've never felt so angry. <laughs> I hope that mouse wasn't on the screen, by the way. Uh, I shouldn't be recording it. Clear-headed. Oh, I don't know if I'm clear-headed right now. That was insane. I've said that so many times now, but it fucking was. Oh. Vivi. Give Zidane a slap, will ya? about that thing, but I'm, I'm just, I'm drained. Oh, here he goes. He is shifting. Uh-oh. Oh, it's, it's still not dead. Okay, so far that is my least favorite enemy in the game. Oh, crap. How can we pass Treno? What, what's beyond Treno? Oh. Would you look at that? Some Oglops just randomly decide to... What are they gonna do? Nothing? Oh crap. <laughs> I guess we're not stopping at Treno then. That poor Gargan must be fucking shit scared. Shoot! That is shifting. Holy shit. And we're dead. Go towards the light dagger. Oh, we haven't heard this music in a while. 
have strict orders from the Queen not to let either of you through. <laughs> so they try the other one. Stay to your business. Queen's guests have arrived. think she was too happy. You two are dismissed. What does that mean? It means fuck off. Yeah. Ho oh, ho, she's not happy. And abrupt end to the theme. <laughs> nice little touch. Whatever to do, are we? Hmm, wonder what they meant by that. What of you? Who are you? What the hell's... Who the hell's that guy? Do you understand who you're talking to? I'm Lani, the best and most beautiful bounty hunter in the world. Well, that's debatable. Um, but yeah, we've, we've heard of Lani before. I do believe she took place took part in the Festival of the Hunt, and she left uh, that message at the inn in Lindblom, if you remember. And uh, she's quite, uh, yeah, boisterous is the word. It's a pleasure to meet you. You could say that again. So, she's hiring bounty hunters to, uh, to hunt down the princess, I'm guessing. Will that go any better than the Black Waltzes, or...? I don't know. We have two objectives. First, you must rescue the DARPA chief, Donald Anderson. Uh, assassinate the Black Mage traveling with him. Oh! Why? A soulless golem. A, a defect is... I, pff, you call Vivi soulless one more time. I'll punch you right in your tits. Hmm. Just get the pendant back from the wretched girl. Max is pleased to hear that. It won't take long. Here's a big axe. So we've got some new enemies to contend with. Red-headed man. Is it true that a boy with a tail is travelling with the princess? Ooh. I was right. Ah, so this guy might know Zidane by the sounds of things. And he just commits suicide. Where's she off to now? I don't like the sound of that. Especially not that, no! What's she planning now? Who's she gonna blow up now? Pinnacle Rocks? That is actually... Well, I don't know. I can't remember what I said earlier on, but um, this is actually a location we sort of have been to before. Very briefly. Looks nice, though. Nice waterfall. We made it. Where the hell are we? Pinnacle Rocks. It's supposed to be near Lindblom Castle. Yes. We have, uh, like I said, we did go towards the entrance, but we couldn't actually enter the place properly. The Gargant took us this far, so yeah, we're really close to Lindblom, which is not a bad place to go if Treno, you know... I mean, we shot, overshot Treno by a fucking mile. Holy crap. Uh, we don't know what happened to those lot. Where is Zidane? You feel okay? Not a clue. About as far away as we could be on this continent. Tantalus guys are with them too. Yeah, I think Marcus and Blank would have rendezvoused with uh, Beatrix and Co. Hmm, maybe we could. Whoa! Creepy ghost man! 
with an exceptional moustache. That is up to you. Ramu, ah. I've heard your name somewhere. Summoning magic, yes. The Thunder God. Yeah, we... Well, I don't know if Dagger did, but we certainly saw it. Quite horrific. An idol and follows its summoner's orders. Hmm. Certainly wasn't, uh, wasn't Dagger. We don't have a clue. If I could use summon magic. That'd be a nice thing to do, yeah. Could probably help our cause. Please help me. And cause more destruction? No. And that is his true form. Look at that beard. Holy crap. So this is actually an Eidolon who's just hanging around. We, we did... Uh, examine a, a notice back at the entrance to this place talking about a ghost of an old man. So, um, so yeah, he's got a little test for us. I will hide five manifestations of myself in this forest. Each one will carry a piece of the hero's story. Collect all five pieces and tell me the story. If you put together the story to my satisfaction, I shall become your Eidolon. So we're gonna try and get some uh, summon magic back. It's okay. We, you know, we're not in any rush. Let's get ourselves a summon magic. And first we shall talk to the Moogle. Because I think uh, I've recorded enough today. I'm going to have a lot of editing to do for that damn fight in the... the, the snake boss thing. Ah, uh, moment. This, oh, this is Monty. We've seen you before. You were in Evil Forest, I think. Wasn't he? I can't remember. He doesn't have any letters? Ah, oh, that sucks. So I'm going to save anyway. Thanks for watching, everyone. Um, bit of a shambles, really, but we did actually do quite well with the optional boss. I uh, didn't steal all I wanted to, but that's that's fine. We'll, we'll get it eventually. Um, hope you enjoyed it, and I shall see you next time, where we will try and track down pieces of this story. And... Uh, and see if we can't get ourselves a summon. So, see you next time. Bye.